Today's rally to publicly bring together the people who represent the majority in our community, that is those who support women's right to decide about abortion, is to say very clearly and unambiguously to Queensland MPs, you need to vote for Rob Pine's bills. Because if you vote them down in a denial of majority community support, you are not fit to be our representatives. And you need to do more than simply vote for the bills. You need to lobby your colleagues across parties to also support these bills. We invited several Queensland MPs to speak at this rally to tell us why they will vote for Rob Pine's bills. All of them, with the exception of Rob Pine, either didn't respond or declined the opportunity. Perhaps they've not yet decided how they'll vote. We're here to tell them, vote for women's rights, vote with long-held community views. There's a myth. There's a myth in Queensland that abortion is easily obtainable. Wrong. While many women in Queensland do access abortion services, probably 11 to 13,000 per annum, get abortions in Queensland, abortion is a crime under Queensland's criminal code. It's only seven years since the Queensland Police charged a young woman and her partner with getting an abortion. Fortunately, the jury that decided that case actually ignored the law and voted for common sense. They found the young couple not guilty. At the time, many people, including the then Queensland Premier, argued initially that the young couple had not been charged with getting an abortion, that they'd been charged with importing an illegal drug. That's not true. I've even seen that claim made in recent months on a feminist Facebook page. The young woman was charged under Section 225 of the Criminal Code, 224 actually, and her partner, five, and her partner was charged under Section 226. 225 reads, any woman who with intent to procure her own miscarriage, whether she is or is not with child, unlawfully administers to herself any poison or other noxious thing, blah, 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 is guilty of a crime and is liable to imprisonment for seven years. End of quote. That's the law. The Cairns jury that found that young couple not guilty did so despite the law, not because of it. Never again should a woman and her partner or their doctor be charged for getting an abortion. The only way to ensure that is to get abortion out of the criminal code. Thank you.